My name is Claire Glasgow. I'm 12 years old. I'm a member of the Smart SA Church and also a Pathfinder. This year, Fun Century, I was in the National Grade Ex Examination, also known as Common Entrance. This year, I was also privileged in winning the Best Narrative Award. This was really exciting for me, being, having written the best story out, the best short story out of 15,000 children in the nation. I also received the, the privilege of getting a placement scholarship. I now attend the Bishop's High School. As a child, it was a lot. It was a lot to wake up early in the morning and to sleep late at night. But I'm glad I did not attend lessons on Sabbath. Luckily for me, our school held lessons, which I was able to benefit from. But during the exam, during all the exams, especially in one where I received the best narrative award. I found myself nervous and having to pray constantly because I wasn't sure of how I would do. So, so I wanted to remember this, to always pray. And also, that education is the key. You can do it just like me. Thank you. I am Claire Glasgow and I am from the New Ghana School. And I will be reading The Best Narrative, A Chaotic Dive. This Tuesday was calm with a gentle breeze and it was a sign of an orderly atmosphere. But the Pitara River disagreed. Instead of homework, regrets would occupy my mind throughout the night. After buckling my pair of shoes, I awkwardly stumbled to Jane's home at the sight of her signal. Jane was a wild spirit, and her mind only seemed to produce idle thoughts. On the contrary, I was a productive mind, but my indecisiveness was an easy prey to skillful persuasion. To make a long story short, when she asked me to skip school to go swimming, I was there. <laughs> Once we arrived, my eyes only faced the waters. Fear climbed up my back, with the thought that I couldn't swim as its main motivation. Jane also was aware of this, but she made up her mind and all those thoughts left her. Even though it was a foolish thing to do, when she dived, I dived. The very minute I entered, the rapids and currents were against us. Jane pushed through, but I found myself falling down the Kaitcher Falls, my fear levels reaching the ultimate high. A mixture of regrets and waves piled on my shoulders like a heavy burden. Unfortunately, a nearby tourist brought me to safety. I spend the rest of the day coughing water, yelling at Jane, and regretting my agreement to her plan. I will never skip school again to go swimming.